I've always wondered why is gold the most valuable metal of all? After all, scientists estimate that the Earth holds around 60 trillion tons of gold. So in terms of sheer quantity, it's not exactly rare. The catch is almost all of it sank into the Earth's core when the planet formed. And with today's technology, there's no way to mine it. The gold we can access today only reached the crust after billions of years of geological processes like tectonic shifts and volcanic eruptions carried it upward. Experts estimate that the world's total mineable gold reserves are about 260,000 tons and we've already extracted 200,000 tons. That leaves just enough to keep mining for another 16 years or so. And since gold is a non-renewable resource, once it's gone, it's gone. But then comes the big question, with so many rare metals out there, why did gold become the universally accepted hard currency? Part of the reason lies in its scarcity and limited supply, but gold also has incredible stability and durability. It doesn't corrode and can last indefinitely without degrading. It's also soft enough to work with, making it easy to shape into jewelry, artifacts, or coins. And unlike silver or iron, gold's warm sunlight glow gives it a unique visual appeal that has strengthened its universal recognition and value. I've always wondered why is gold the most valuable metal of all? After all, scientists estimate that the Earth holds around 60 trillion tons of...